What is up YouTube? How's everybody out there doing today? We have a freaking crazy good video for you guys today. Thanks to good old rough country. And as you know, rough country has had a lot to do with this beautiful truck. Mainly the awesome lift kit that's on this thing that has, oh my God, I almost died. I almost died in the Terry Hill sinkhole. Oh my Lord. That's a good start to a video. <laughs> Anyways, as you guys know, Rough Country has been a part of this build with their 6-inch lift kit and their kicker bars up front. And that lift kit is holding up very, very good. Very, very strong. The shocks are holding up very, very good. Needless to say, very happy with the truck. And everybody that sees this truck loves this truck. So Rough Country came in clutch one more time for me and sent me some cool flag post holders. They make two different versions. So the first version is this style here that bolt up on the inside of your rail, which I kind of like because they are out of the way. And they also make a hitch version too. Um, <clears throat> I decided to go with this version mainly because of uh, ease of transportation. And, uh, you know, I could take it off, take these poles out when I want to and put them back in when I want to. Um, cruising around the town and, you know, showing off my pride as an American and, uh, some other flags that I have, which if you guys wait to the end of the video here, you will see I bought three flags. I already had them. I bought them new, knowing I was getting this, but I bought an American flag. because That's normal. You have to buy an American flag. It's very, very nice, double stitched, weatherproof American flag that I found on Amazon. Dirt cheap. Um, and then I bought two other flags. Uh, but like I said, you have to wait to the end of the video to see them. But let's get these installed and see what they look like. Should be pretty, pretty cool. I'm actually pretty excited to have these on the truck. Just to represent, um, I might even get a Marine Corps flag as well, possibly, too. Um, I should definitely have one of those to put in here and, and flaunt around. But uh, one of the first things you need to do is you need to take out your tail lights. So whether you have aftermarket or OEM stock, they got to come out because you have these install kits right here with bolts. Now to obviously drill some holes and line everything up, level it out, make sure it's good to go. But let's get those tail lights out. All right, tail lights are out, and as you can see, it does give you really good access to in there uh, to be able to bolt everything together, drill your holes, and bolt these plates into place and make them nice and secure. They've got these locking tabs for the back that hold on that you can just screw in, which is really, really nice, and, uh, and stuff like that. So let's get our holes drilled. I'm not quite sure what size they are, but we're going to figure it out. I'm going to go ahead and get these uh, these mounted. Pretty simple setup. Not very hard to do. Not very hard to do at all. All right, guys. So I'm going to have to modify mine a little bit just because of the placement. I could put them here, but I don't want them there. I want them on the bed rail here. And as you can see, the bed tailgate kind of touches and impedes this a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to shave down this edge just to get it squared up a little bit better. Because um, that's where I want it. I, I want it over here. A little bit but more i don't want to put it here as much as i could i mean i could put it here i guess nah. nah nah i want it i want it here i want it there so i'm going to do some modifications to this to make it work to where i want it all right little modification little spray paint and we are good to go guys we're gonna let this dry and then we're gonna drill our holes all right, so we have it stationary, and I just sat it there for right now just to get an idea of where the bolt holes need to be. But it is pretty dang tall <laughs> of a post, as you guys can see. That's crazy. This is going to look freaking wild, guys. Let's mark the holes, drill the sides, and start assembling. All right, so we have them bolted in. Um, don't pay no, never mind my janky install. But uh, as you can see, the... The stoppers are right there, the, the level, whatever you want to call them things. But uh, she fits real nice. Nice and sturdy. This definitely is not going anywhere. Let's close the... Okay. That's, that's that nut there. That's what that is. Well, it's definitely nice and tight now. <laughs> that's for sure. Ugh. Let's see here. Yeah, I'm going to take a hammer and dent that in a little bit. That way that doesn't interfere. And it looks like this one's fine over here. It's basically just this bolt here. So I'm going to dent my tailgate in a little bit. Right about there. We're going to go get a hammer. You know what they say. 
there's nothing in this world that a BFH can't freaking solve. <laughs> so we're basically just gonna massage it a little bit. There we go. See? Massage, that's all. A little massaging. Didn't hurt anybody. Yeah, yeah. I think this side is good. Touching a little bit, but I think that's okay. Let's see if we can close this thing all the way here. Yeah, look at that. Fixed. See? Not that hard, guys. Not that hard. <laughs> now that the posts are in place, we're going to go ahead and put our staffs or our extended posts up on both sides and then put our tail lights in and get that all done and then it's time to put the flags on guys and i think you guys are going to be freaking excited about it <laughs> all right guys our posts are in everything's buttoned up we got our tail lights in and all that fun jazz these things are stable as hell i'm not gonna lie to you guys put that in there where it belongs these things ain't going anywhere this ain't coming out like they're in there really 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 good and really really strong i might come back later after some time and double check the taps and everything double check the bolts make sure everything's good to go but i guess it's time to show you our beautiful flag and look who showed up for the event <laughs> i just seen it go down the road <laughs> my god talk about red neck <laughs> he's gonna come around and we're gonna reveal the two flags actually i have three flags I'll show you the third flag after this, but the third flag is really funny, really, really funny. I'm not going to lie, um, but the two flags I got are very, very good. Obviously, one of them is an American flag. You all know that you can't uh, you can't deny an American flag on a, on a pick me up truck. So where's he at? I hear him. <laughs> he probably probably feels like he needs to do chewing tobacco and have beer cans in the bed of the truck now. Here he comes, guys. <laughs> Here he comes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tell me that's not the coolest thing ever, guys. Tell me that's not the coolest thing ever. The freaking American flag and Blackbeard's flag. Freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. We're gonna get Zach back here. We're gonna show you the third flag I got, which is hilarious, to be honest. And I'll switch out the Blackbeard flag for the, for the, look at that. Oh my God, I'm, my... what do you think there, Zach? Are they noisy? For real? Interesting. They look pretty though. They look smexy. Big thanks to Rough Country for the flag posts. Freaking awesome product, guys. Link in the description below. If you are interested in these flag posts, they are just amazing. They're just amazing. Zach, get the other flag out. I want to show them the other flag. Blackbeard's flag. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Get the other one out so I can show them the other one. They're really noisy. Are they noisy? Well, yeah, they're going in the wind. <laughs> We're going to show them the third flag that we have here, which is hilarious. I seen it on Amazon and I had to have it. I had to have it. Hopefully it doesn't blow around too much. Make sure it's not upside down. Oh yeah. Turn around the other way. There you go. Here like this. Hold it like this, buddy, so you can see the whole thing. <laughs> no step on snack. That will also be flying on the old Dirty Max eventually. But we switched them out. But that's a funny flag. I just had to have it because it's so funny. Zach likes it too. But we're going to run the Blackbeard flag for a while. What do you think, Zach? You're like, eh. Like I said, guys, huge, gigantic thanks to Rough Country for sending me these flag posts. They are freaking awesome. I am super stoked and super happy to have them. They look amazing on the truck, by the way. I'm just amazing on the truck. Um, I, I like them. They're, what do you think? Oh, Zach's leaving. <laughs> Zach don't care. Zach's like, whatever, Dad. I'm out. 
<laughs> oh, that's awesome. That is awesome. <laughs> We're doing a speed test too early. We're doing 45 miles an hour. Going over to get the ZL1. And man, that, that freaking American flag. Is it is kicking ass. It's holding. Hasn't fell off yet. <laughs> The other one's a lighter flag. I might end up getting a, a, a like a, a, a thinner American flag, honestly. Cause that one was a heavy duty one, like double stitched, double sided. And it's, it's kicking around a lot. And it's waterproof too, but that's why I bought it. So I might buy a, a cheaper, uh, thinner flag possibly for, uh, for the truck at least and keep this flag for something else. Maybe I'll put it out front of the shop or something. Who knows? There's Zach in the old Dirty Max. I'm in the old Camaro ZL1. And them flags are going, guys. They are going. That's so freaking awesome. Look at that. Look at that. There's another American flag. Freaking awesome. Awesome product from Rough Country, guys. Awesome product. Let's get back to the shop and uh, end this video for all this time. Well, guys, we are back at the shop with the ZL1 Camaro and also the Duramax. And as you guys seen, man, she did good. She did real good. These flag posts at literally 50 miles an hour. Zach was going 50 miles an hour. They move around a lot, but I tell you what, guys, they ain't going, they're not going anywhere. Them welds are going to break before them bolts come out. And I'm kind of glad they move around because it gives a little bit of a uh, little bit of give why it's going down the road, which is nice too. Very, very nice. Awesome. Very happy with this product. I highly recommend it. If you uh, like flags, they also do a hitch one, like I said in the beginning of the video, but if you like flags, posts and flags and so on and so forth there you go guys that's what you need to be getting right there all right guys that's the end of the video hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe instagram diablo formula racing and as always please go down there and check out all the sponsors in the sponsors list including rough country of course you know what they say there's nothing a bfa you know what they say there's nothing but a b you know what they say nothing but a bhf You know what they say, nothing like a BFH.